Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you a cool site called MyOats.com And I'm, if you guys have subscribed to Locker Gnome, um, link will be in the description to his channel um, He has already made a video on this, but I just got the idea from him And I just thought I'd share it with you to all my subscribers who haven't subscribed to him And telling you to go subscribe to him, so that's a shout out for him And his um, name is Chris Perillo if that rings any bells um yeah so what i'm sh see um if i go to my desktop and i and you see like this really cool image or some random image that's made from myoats.com and um what my oats is is like creating your own desktop without like logging in or signing up or anything just yeah so what you do is just open up your web browser then go to www.myoats.com m y o a t s dot com and just click enter and it'll just take you to this page as you can see it has really cool designs like made by other people but if you want you can join now just click here join now but what you want to click is create yours which is right beside join now and as you can see to start you just draw inside the circle you can't draw outside for some reason that just moves the image and what it does you can just start from the center and look it like automatically creates some lines. You could make some crazy things, which uh, like let's say you start from one side, it also does that for the other side, so you don't have to like waste all your time just like doing everything. And at the bottom, you can do edit, clear, undo what you just did, view. You could do gradient, drag point, center stage, sides. You can make them larger like that, or very small like that. That looks very disturbing. Okay, I prefer it like that. And for tools, you could use a smooth pencil, a filled smooth pencil, a pencil, a filled pencil, an ellipse tool, a filled ellipse, a polygon, a filled polygon, and a line. Which, which I'm using right now is a line. A line size can be big, and then look what happens. You could make it like that, and if you want, you can make it small. Uh, whoops. Make it small, and do it like that and look it already looks pretty cool and without like uh like going through all the time like going into photoshop or to gimp you could just use this simple like like uh the simple website that like helps you create your own like wallpaper without any like any problems all right and opacity could make it smaller make it transparent a bit and you can see there's like a nice cool design. The intensity can increase the intensity, which I don't think that's good. It doesn't look that great. And increase the intensity to the smallest size. But I like to keep it somewhere in the middle. Zoom, you can zoom in, which can fill up your whole desktop. Or you could just zoom out and leave that. It doesn't look good, so I would keep it at like 105%. Stage color, which is the background, uh, you can make it green, uh, whatever color suits you best. I like I like this color, like a little red. All right, and shape color, it could it just you could just choose the color for what you have drawn right now. So I'm gonna go with whatever matches. Uh, yeah, yellow. All right, so after you're done creating your image, just cl click at the top left corner, just just drag your mouse over it. You could click download. Wallpaper, download your design, download HD design, download geometry, and download HD geometry. What I'm going to do is download the wallpaper. And th what the cool thing is, is if you have an iPhone, you could click download wallpaper to iPhone. But um, I don't have an iPhone, but if you know how to do this with an iPhone, click download iPhone. But what we're doing now is downloading it to the desktop. So just click desktop. And... And in the top right corner, it'll say creating, so we'll just wait a bit. Wait. Oh, my bad. It said air. Okay. Desktop. My bad, guys. And as you can see, my out is still in beta, so. But it looks like an amazing site. Could be used for future things. Um. The thing I don't like about it is you can't draw anywhere else. You can only draw inside one circle. But um, I guess if you use the zoom tool, I guess you can 
like make it fill up your whole desktop but I like something more in the middle not like something very big uh, so that way I can't see the names of my files or anything so yeah so okay I don't know what's taking this so long but um another way to do this if you just click save as and it'll start creating a preview huh why is this taking so long alright um yeah I'll just pause the video and I'll be right back when this is done okay back again guys so after that's done it'll uh... it'll ask you to if you wanna open it open this file or save this file so what you wanna do is you actually just click save and choose where you want to save it so I'm gonna save it to my desktop and click save and yeah it'll already be saved so I'm gonna go to my desktop now and as you can see it's, it's right in this corner right here and what I can do is just right click it and then click set as desktop background and there you go it's set as your desktop background you have a nice cool design you know, something nice in the middle and yeah it's really cool guys I and if you want to save some space, you could just throw it away right after and empty recycle bin. Or if you guys have Windows 7, you could create a slideshow, which helps your image change over time. Like maybe after like two, ten minutes, yeah, one day. And it looks really cool. I really like this site. I recommend it to everyone who wants to create a nice design for their desktop background. And yeah, I rate this uh, website uh 9.5 out of 10 and I'll include a link in the description please rate comment subscribe add me as a friend add me on Twitter uh, every, that'll be in the description I don't use Skype anymore guys I just found it's kind of stupid I, I just found it e easier just to answer personal messages on YouTube instead rather than just people adding me on Skype so if you want to add me on Skype go ahead because like, I'm not even going to go on anymore, but if you want a friend, just, yeah. Alright, thanks for watching, and I hope this helps you in the future. Bye.